In this episode of Aviation This Week, Auto Aviation introduces the Solera 500L, then Textron celebrates five years of citation latitude, and the Camcopter delivers 3D printed parts to an offshore oil platform. Auto Aviation of California on August 27th introduced its propeller-driven Solera 500L prototype. The aircraft took on the nickname Bullet Plane after it was first spotted more than two years ago, as reported by aviation news outlet The War Zone. Auto Aviation states the Solera 500L, with seven U.S. patents, has now completed 31 test flights in addition to a range of parts production and manufacturing milestones as it works towards certifications. The company explains that the aircraft's bullet shape is based on laminar flow, which provides a 59% reduction in drag compared to a similar-sized conventional aircraft, resulting in a 5 to 7 times reduction in operating costs, as well as 8 times lower fuel consumption. Auto aviation is targeting speeds of up to 460 miles per hour in a transcontinental range of 4,500 nautical miles. With a planned payload for six passengers, the Solera 500L is powered by the Red A03 V12 four-stroke diesel engine built by Red Aircraft of Germany. Textron Aviation on August 27th celebrated five years since the first customer delivery of its Cessna Citation Latitude aircraft, described as the world's most delivered mid-sized business jet for four consecutive years. In terms of its market success, Textron points to the aircraft's versatility and 2,700 nautical mile range. With nearly 240 delivered to date, the Citation Latitude jet now comprises more than 40% of all mid-sized business jet deliveries since 2015, surpassing 320,000 fleet hours since entry into service. The aircraft's success is largely tied to private aviation company NetJets, which has taken more than 120 deliveries. Rated to carry up to seven passengers, the Citation Latitude holds the ability to fly non-stop between destinations like Los Angeles and New York or Geneva and Dubai. It has earned certification in more than 40 countries. Shebel, together with partner Nordic Unmanned, demonstrated the cargo delivery capability of the Camcopter S100 to an offshore platform owned by Norwegian energy company Equinor. Described by the Austrian UAV maker as a world first, this exercise simulated the scenario of an urgent requirement for spare parts at Equinor's active Troll A gas production platform in the North Sea. The camcopter traveled 100 kilometers from the shore in Mongstad, where the spare parts were 3D printed. The trial also included a successful search and rescue mission, locating a dummy in the water using an L3 Harris Westcam camera. After the UAV supplied the spare parts, it carried out an inspection of the platform before heading back to Mongstadt.